Install mode is a 4100 ES facility which is useful during panel installation. While a 4100 ES panel is being installed and commissioned, there will often be periods when many internal modules or external devices are not yet connected, or are not in a normal state for some reason. With the full configuration loaded in the 4100 ES, each missing or off normal device gives rise to a fault. Having the fault list full of faults from devices that are known to be missing or off normal can make it difficult to work with the faults from devices that are actually present. Install mode provides a means to hide known faults from being displayed. Any internal module or external device can be added to the install mode list using the front panel interface. If there is any device in the install mode list, there will be a single fault indication, install mode active. However, the devices in the install mode list will not produce fault indications, even if they are missing or faulty. All the individual device faults are hidden behind a single install mode active fault. As modules and devices are progressively added to the system and normalized, they can be removed from the install mode list. When the system is fully commissioned, the install mode list should be empty. Adding a single device to install mode. Devices can be added individually to the install mode list. Take note that this requires being logged in at level 3. The example fault list shows a fault from a missing slave card in the panel. If necessary, move the highlight on the display to the missing card, using the up, down, page up or page down keys. Press the more soft key for more info. Move the highlight down to the card status line. A soft key option ad will appear. Pressing this soft key will add this point to the install mode list and display an accepted screen briefly. Pressing the fault acknowledge key will show the fault list, now with a single entry. Adding multiple devices to install mode. Where there are many missing devices, all producing faults, there are simple ways to quickly add these to the install mode list in bulk. Take note that this requires being logged in at level 3. Press menu, then scroll the highlight to the service or diagnostics option and press the select soft key to select it. In the diagnostic menu screen, scroll down to the install mode option. There are many diagnostic options, so using page down to jump a screen at a time will be faster. Press the select soft key to select it. In the install mode menu, move the highlight to the add missing option, and press select to select this option. The panel will take a few seconds to search for all missing devices and add them to the install mode list. Note that the fault count has changed from 5 above to just 1 below. The single remaining fault is the install mode fault. Viewing devices in install mode. Press menu, then scroll the highlight to the service or diagnostics option and press the select soft key to select it. In the diagnostic menu screen, scroll down to the install mode option. There are many diagnostic options, so using page down to jump a screen at a time will be faster. Press the select soft key to select it. The contents of the install mode list can be viewed with the view option of the install mode menu. Viewing this menu does not require being logged in. The install mode display shows the device count, and a list of devices and modules with the current status. A more soft key will provide more info for the highlighted entry in the list. Removing individual devices from install mode. If you are logged at level 3, you can remove individual devices from the install mode list. Display the install mode list, move the highlight to the device you wish to remove, and press the more soft key to see more info. Move the highlight to the card status or device status line, when a remove soft key option will appear. Pressing the remove soft key will remove this device from the install mode list. If the device is still in fault, the system fault count will increase and the fault indicator will flash for a new fault. Removing many points from install mode. Just as many missing devices can be added to the install mode list quickly, so can many devices be removed from the list. In the install mode menu screen, you can choose to remove all devices in the install mode list that are now normal, using the remove all normal points option. This is probably the most useful bulk option, since it will automatically leave the devices in fault behind, and allow them to easily view. If all the devices in the install mode list are normal, then selecting this action will also cancel the install mode fault. Alternatively, you can choose to remove all devices from the install mode list, regardless of their status, with the remove all points option. 
Note that this may result in a large number of new fault indications if there are faulty devices. That's all folks. Please hit the button to subscribe and hit the bell to keep you updated. Thank you for watching.